where are the aliens and why haven't they called lately? Remember the Drake equation from part one? Well, to figure out the number of intelligent civilizations, we need to add a few more terms. To the number of planets that develop life, we add the fraction of planets that develop intelligent life times the number of those that develop radio technology times the lifetime of their civilization. I suspect that technology is a fairly inevitable outcome of intelligence, but the other two terms are trickier. Life existed on Earth for billions of years before we came about, and it's hard to say if we're an unlikely accident or the inevitable product of enough time. Considering how our species has proliferated, intelligence seems to offer an evolutionary advantage. But it's tough to say if this is short-lived. How long will we survive now that we can wipe ourselves out in the blink of an eye? It could be that there are tons of worlds with life, but very few with intelligence. Or it could be that civilization birth and extinction are all too common features with civilizations blinking on and off like a light bulb. Surely, with billions and billions of stars, other civilizations must have arisen. But because evolutionary processes take billions of years, they would probably be either way ahead of us or way behind us in technology. With our advances in computing and robotics, it's possible to imagine a civilization that would send out swarms of self-replicating robots, overriding all accessible systems in a matter of a few million years, even traveling much slower than light. So why are we here? Why haven't the aliens already come to Earth? Perhaps they have no interest in our world. Perhaps they are so far away that the vast distances have so far prevented contact. Perhaps truly advanced beings just stay at home, finding ways to entertain themselves, or transcend their biological form. Or perhaps they just haven't noticed us yet. Whatever the case, if there were other intelligent beings out there, would it be dangerous to try to contact them? It might be, and considering the history of human expansion, first contact doesn't always work out favorably for the more primitive society. The vast distances involved means that it's probably impractical for aliens to go around conquering other civilizations, at least as is portrayed in the movies. However, considering the imminent potential for self-annihilation, perhaps only truly peaceful and highly ethical societies are able to survive in the long run. In any case, we have the technology to survey the darkness for signals from other worlds. If they're close enough, and if they're transmitting with enough power, we should be able to hear them. The answers are out there, and it never hurts to listen.